Hello! Welcome to our part 2 video. Let's learn about how to simplify a fraction. We get into rascals too. Let's go! In part 1 video, we learn about fraction and examples of fraction. If you haven't watched our part 1 video about fraction, please do so. So you will have a complete understanding about fraction. Now, in this part 2 video, we will specifically look at how to simplify a fraction. Let's go! Let me begin with an example here. 5 10. This is a fraction. But, is this a simplest form of fraction for 5 tenths? To check if a fraction can still be simplified further, first, we need to check if the bottom number which is called denominator, is dividable by the top number, which is the numerator, and still giving you result as whole number, 5 tenths. Let's first check if 10 is dividable by 5. The answer is yes. When you divide 10 with 5, it gives you result as 2, which is an exact division. Because 5 is the factor for 10. To simplify a fraction, always remember, you need to divide both top and bottom number with the same number. And both need to give you an exact division as a result. So, both top and bottom numbers need to be divided by 5. We divide 5 with 5, it gives us 1. We divide 10 with 5, it gives us 2. So, it gives us half. But, is half the simplest fraction can be for 5 10? The answer is yes. Why? Because you can't divide the top and bottom numbers any further without still giving whole number as the result. So, half is the simplest form for 5 10. If you are not familiar with division calculation, not to worry, please watch our learning video about division. Only epic and the rascals fun videos. Let's try another example. 9 12 Can this fraction be simplified further? First, please check. Is the bottom number 12 dividable by the top number 9? The answer is... No! Why? 9 is not the factor for 12. Then, let's check if number 9 and 12 have the same common factor that can be used to divide them and give us exact division as a result. Let's recall our memory about multiplication. We know that 3 times 3 equals to 9 and 3 times 4 equals to 12. From the above multiplication, we see that number 9 and 12 both have the same common factor, number 3. So they both are actually dividable by 3. Let's try. Both top and bottom numbers need to be divided by 3. We divide 9 with 3, it gives us 3. We divide 12 with 3, it gives us 4. So, it gives us 3 quarter or 3 out of 4. But is 3 out of 4 or 3 quarter the simplest fraction can be for 9 12? The answer is yes. Why? Because you can't divide the top and bottom number any further without giving whole number as the result. The bottom number 4 is not dividable by the top number 3 and both don't have any common factor anymore that can be used to divide them and gives us exact division. So, 3 quarter is the simplest form for 9 12. Now, let's test our knowledge. Let's visit our galaxy that currently is under attack by 18 alien monsters. Yes! 18 of them! Lots of them! So what to do? 
Let's now meet Sam in his flying saucer to save the Earth. Sam is catching the alien monster one by one from attacking the Earth. Now, let's ask Sam. Have you caught all the alien monsters? Sam replied, I have caught six out of 18 alien monsters. Now, can you please tell us the fraction form of 6 out of 18 alien monsters that have been caught by Sam? And, can you simplify it? And how much more in fraction of the 18 alien monsters that Sam still needs to catch? Okay, let's do it! Please feel free to freeze this video when you do your calculation. Ready? Have you got your answer? Let's investigate together. Sam caught 6 out of 18 alien monsters. So the fraction form is 6 out of 18. Easy. Then let's do the checking. If this 6 out of 18 is the simplest fraction form can be. The answer is no. Why? Let's first check if bottom number 18 is dividable by the top number 6. Yes, 18 is dividable by 6. So this fraction can still be simplified further. Let's divide both top and bottom numbers with 6. To simplify a fraction, both top and bottom numbers have to be divided by the same common factor which is number 6. 6 divided by 6, it gives us 1. 18 divided by 6, it gives us 3. The result is 1 third. And this is the simple fraction can be, because top and bottom numbers can't be divided any further without still giving whole number as the result. So, Sam has caught one third of the 18 alien monsters. Well done, Sam! If you're more familiar with division, not to worry. Please watch our fun learning videos about division only at Big and Little Rascals fun learning videos. And how much more in fraction Sam still needs to catch? Sam has caught one third of 18 alien monsters. Let's put total 18 alien monsters as one whole lot of monster troop. So, 1 minus 1 third. First, let's chain 1 to fraction form. 3 out of 3. Because 3 divided by 3 equals to 1. But why we use number 3? So, it matches with one third. The bottom number is the same, so we can subtract the fraction easily. 3 out of 3 minus 1 out of 3. First, 3 minus 1, it gives us 2. And the bottom number 3 follows here. The result is 2 third. So, Sam still needs to catch 2 third of 18 alien monsters in order to save the Earth. Have you got your answer correct? Well done! If you don't get it right, not to worry. Repeat this video and keep on practicing. Practice makes perfect. Please watch our fun learning in multiplication and division so you can be an expert. Hope you enjoy this fun learning video and you understand about how to simplify a fraction. Do check out our other fun learning videos. Please don't forget to subscribe and continue your fun learning with us. Thank you for watching. See you later.